Was Nikola Tesla only building for his own age, or was he quietly leaving blueprints for ours? His life was filled with visions that stretched far beyond the reach of his century, ideas too vast for the tools of his time. Now, one of his forgotten sketches has re-emerged, reborn through the most advanced quantum technology ever created. What appeared to be a fragment of his imagination has become a working machine, humming with mysteries we cannot yet explain. In this story, the past and future collapse into each other, and Tesla's silence begins to speak again. Tesla's Vision Nikola Tesla was born in 1856, in a small village surrounded by mountains and rivers. His father was a priest, but his mother was different. She built small tools and devices with her own hands, turning everyday problems into solutions. From her, Tesla inherited not just curiosity, but a gift for imagining machines that did not yet exist. As a boy, he discovered he could see inventions in his mind. He would rotate them, take them apart, and perfect them without touching a single piece of metal. This strange ability set him apart from others and became the core of his genius. Years later, Tesla arrived in America with little money and big dreams. He soon worked with Thomas Edison, but their paths quickly split. Edison defended direct current, while Tesla believed alternating current was the true future. That belief sparked a conflict remembered as the war of the current's history chose Tesla's vision. His alternating current became the lifeblood of modern power. Legacy of a troubled genius. Tesla's life was shaped by inventions that seemed almost impossible for his age. He created motors powered by invisible fields, coils that sparked like controlled lightning, and experiments that hinted at power without wires. His dream was bold, energy that could travel freely through the air, reaching anyone, anywhere. The Wardenclyffe Tower was meant to prove it. Rising from the ground like a strange monument, it was designed to send electricity across oceans. To many, it looked like a promise of freedom. To others, it was frightening, even dangerous. Investors pulled away, and the project collapsed before it could be finished. Tesla never stopped imagining. He spoke of machines powered by the Earth itself, of ships without fuel, of messages sent instantly across the globe. Yet while his words inspired, they also left him isolated. In the end, his wealth faded, his habits grew stranger, and his name carried the weight of brilliance mixed with loneliness. Tesla's Notebooks and the Mystery When Tesla died in 1943, he was alone in a New York hotel room. The news spread quietly, but within hours, officials arrived. Trunks filled with papers, strange models, and scattered devices were gathered and taken away. Some of those materials were eventually released. Others vanished into locked archives or private hands. That sudden removal created endless speculation. People spoke of hidden weapons, wireless energy grids, even devices that could tap into the planet itself. Historians tried to calm the rumors, pointing out that many of his pages were only rough sketches, half-finished notes, or wild ideas not meant for testing. But that very uncertainty gave birth to myths. If one design could become real decades later, what else might have been possible? Were those missing documents lost by chance? Or hidden because they contained something too powerful for the world to see? In Tesla's notebooks, the line between imagination and invention was always blurred. And in those blurred lines, mystery found a home. The sketch rediscovered. Among the surviving fragments of Tesla's work was a single page that seemed almost meaningless at first glance. The paper was yellow with age, the lines faint, the handwriting uneven. It showed a small cylinder drawn with incomplete shapes, 
symbols scattered in the margins. For decades, it was little more than a curiosity kept in archives. Researchers have studied it many times. Some thought it was a rough draft for a motor. Others believed it was simply abandoned because it could not work. The details were too vague, the proportions unclear, the purpose unknown. For years, it remained an unsolved puzzle. Only in recent times did new eyes begin to look at it differently. Not human eyes, but machines capable of reading between the lines. With the help of advanced computation, that forgotten sketch was no longer just a fading trace of ink. It became a seed waiting for the right soil. And once placed into the world of quantum AI, it began to grow into something real. Quantum AI explained. To understand why Tesla's forgotten sketch could be revived, we need to understand quantum AI. It is the merging of two powerful ideas, quantum computing and artificial intelligence. Traditional computers use bits, simple zeros and ones. Quantum computers use qubits, which can exist in more than one state at the same time. This allows them to test countless possibilities all at once, instead of step by step. It means they can explore problems so complex that ordinary machines would take centuries to solve. Artificial intelligence, on the other hand, learns from patterns. It studies massive amounts of data, makes predictions, and builds connections humans might miss. When AI is joined with quantum computing, the result is a system that can both imagine and test ideas at a speed we cannot match. This is why Tesla's sketch mattered. It was not a complete plan. It was more like a whisper of an idea. A human engineer could only guess at what he meant. But quantum AI could run through thousands of versions, rejecting failures, refining shapes, and searching for the one design that worked. It was a bridge between Tesla's vision and our reality, reconstructing the machine. The process began with a high-resolution scan of the fragile sketch. Every faded line, every faint mark, was captured in detail. Historians studied Tesla's handwriting and noted a few key words. Resonance, rotation, and magnetic coupling. These became clues for what the design might mean. From there, engineers built a digital model, filling in the missing spaces as carefully as possible. The proportions were guessed from Tesla's other designs, but the drawing was still too incomplete to stand on its own. That is where quantum AI entered. The system treated the sketch as an unfinished puzzle. It created thousands of versions, shifting coils, adjusting plates, and testing materials. Each version was placed into a simulated environment where stability, efficiency, and strength were measured. Human experts guided the process, comparing each result with Tesla's known work. Historians kept the AII from straying too far. Engineers confirmed whether the models could actually be built. Step by step, the design narrowed toward a single form. Finally, the system reached a point of balance. The virtual prototype performed reliably in simulation. It was not just theory anymore. It was a machine ready to be built in the real world, the cylindrical engine. When the prototype was finally assembled, it looked simple, almost ordinary. A small cylinder of brushed metal about the size of a thermos, resting quietly on a table. Copper terminals extended from its base, polished and bright. Through a narrow window in the casing, layers of coiled wires could be seen wrapping around a hollow chamber. Inside that chamber was something unusual. A delicate lattice-like structure, created by the AI, shaped to catch and guide electromagnetic fields. At first, it appeared decorative, but its geometry matched faint marks in Tesla's sketch. Marks that had long been ignored. The first test was cautious. A small current was applied. Instruments detected a sudden, stable resonance, 
The frequency held steady for more than an hour, with almost no heat buildup. Energy consumption was far lower than expected. When the current increased, the device began to hum softly. The casing vibrated, and the inner lattice seemed to focus energy toward its center. It did not behave like a normal motor or coil. It was something different, something that felt both familiar and entirely new. Expert Reactions When the prototype was shown to experts, the responses carried both caution and awe. Engineers were struck by its efficiency. It generated a stable resonance while drawing little energy, something unusual for such a small device. They admitted it was not yet practical for wide use, but the principle felt significant, as though it revealed a path science had overlooked. Physicists looked deeper into the field patterns inside the chamber. What they saw did not align with the usual behavior of motors or resonant coils. Instead, it suggested Tesla had been exploring an unfamiliar middle ground, a design that blended known physics with something not fully understood. It was difficult to classify, and that uncertainty only deepened the mystery. Historians saw meaning in the process itself. A sketch once dismissed as incomplete had come alive through technology far beyond Tesla's time. They noted that invention does not always belong to a single era. Sometimes, ideas wait in silence until the right tools appear to give them form. This small cylinder seemed to confirm that Tesla's work was more layered than history allowed. He was neither only a dreamer, nor only an engineer, but both. His visions reached too far for his own age, yet they left behind seeds. And today, with quantum AI, one of those seeds has finally grown. From a single faded sketch, a machine has risen that bridges two centuries. It is small, imperfect, and yet it speaks of something larger, a dialogue between vision and time. Tesla may not have built it with his own hands, but his idea survived long enough to be born again through tools he could never have imagined. What other pages, what other forgotten lines, still wait in silence? History is not finished. It lingers, waiting for us to listen. Share your thoughts below, and remember, sometimes the past is only the beginning of what comes next.